Gotta roll your sleeves up for this. Ooh, my button's kind of loose. That's not good. All right, so we are gonna open the box. Apparently, it's got a lithium-ion battery. I did not know that. That's interesting. Blah, 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 Google Home. Now that's interesting. Huh. We're gonna have a little talk about this. Anyway, um, let's see. Ta-da! This is it, this is Google Home. What's included? Google Home, AC power adapter, that's required. So, uh, this doesn't work well without it. Uh, here's the box. Man. This lens is pretty poopy. Pretty poopy lens. Very poopy lens. This is not in focus, and I'm very sorry. Pretty cool, shows you kind of some questions and conversations that you could have with the Google Assistant there um, with my crappy lens. Fo fo focus, focus. It can't focus. So, no knife at this point. We'll pull tabs, we'll pull that, there we go. Another one over here, like that. Lift this up. Oh, interesting. The box kind of like does this thing, and you have this really nice reveal. And there it is. The Google Home. So I'm going to change perspective on the camera so you can kind of see the uh, setup from this point. So. All right. So clearly, I need to get a wider lens because if I'm that it just this thing's not that great. There we go. So we lift up, and then, oh, broke the box already. Oh, that comes the whole way off. Ha! And then, get this nice little cute pull tab here. And ta-da! There it is. So we'll take this out. Kind of rests in there. Um, so here's the little, I think these come in different colors. You can order these online. This just twist it off. And then in the bottom, looks like maybe three speakers. A big one there, one there. Another one there, and then we can see the, looks like a micro USB right there where we'll plug the power in. So that's it. And then there's the, uh, the mute button on the back. So let me pop this back on. Oh, it's I think it's got a magnet. It just kind of snaps into place. That's really cool. So you just line it up and it snaps right in. So I guess you can change the colors on, on that. So there it is. Uh, we'll open up the box. I don't really know what that is. That's just on lining up. All right. Here we go. Oh, wow. That's nice. It's packaged nicely in there. Power cable. Let's get that out. There's that. All right. So here we go. Getting started. And it says plug power cable into Google Home. Plug power adapter into a wall socket and download and run the Google Home app on a phone or tablet. And then it's got some suggestions on what to do. Um, it talks about how you can design it. And then there's all the fine print. That... Good luck with that. Um, okay, so we're gonna plug it in now. So here we are, right into the bottom of the unit. Plugs like that. Lights on, we know we're good. Okay, so there that is. Now, we have to <clears throat> install this app. So we're gonna go and look for this app. So, got my phone, we will go. To, oh, there it is. Welcome to Google Home. To get started, download the Google Home app on a phone or tablet. So we're going to look for Google Home. Oh, and hey, we already have Google Home installed because that's what we use for our Chromecast. And unfortunately, it stopped. Of course it did. There it is. Oh, here we go. Google Home found. So I'm going to turn the autofocus off on this because it is really kind of obnoxious. There we go. Way better. You can now, I can't, I was hoping I could zoom in. You can now see what's going on on my phone, which is really 
kind of what I was going for. So my apologies for before. All right, Google Home found. There are just a few steps to set up and personalize your Google Home. Connecting to Google Home. So it's creating a, a temporary hotspot and connecting to my Google Home with that. And it can't connect. Wonderful. It's always a good start um, when you have something new like this that it works so well um, from the very beginning. So, uh, oh, let's turn off auto network switch. We're going to turn that off. So make sure you have smart network switch turned off. So now we're back here and it says it's connecting. Da, 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 da. Still connecting. I think it's not actually doing anything. I don't know. It's kind of taking a while. Alright, I'm going to cancel it and we'll go back. We're going to try it again. So, here we go. Set up. Let's see if it does it this time. Oh, continue. Here we go. Hey, look, it's connected this time. So it was that smart switch. You need to make sure you have that turned off. And um, kind of still waiting again. Hey, it's moving. That's good. That's good. We got movement. We've got movement. Okay, it's going to play a test sound, so we're going to click. Yeah, we heard that. Did you hear the sound? Yep. Then select a network is poor signal quality. We recommend connecting. A... Okay, got it. I don't. That's not really the case. Um, yep, we'll let it get the Wi-Fi password for me and continue. Hey, that's, it's like all gold, so I think that's good. I think that's good. I think we're good. So we're going to click Continue. Now it says Meet Your Google Assistant. Google Home is powered by the Google Assistant. Ask it questions, tell it to do things. To get started, connect your Google account. Okay, so we're going to sign in. going to continue as me. And forgive me for a second while I update my address. Alright, so I've turned on email notifications and Google Play Music, so you can pick all these different music things. I use Google Play Music, um, which is great. Alright, so now it's installing the updates. Oh, look at that. I just got an update on my watch, which I don't know. Probably couldn't read it because it wasn't focused. All right, so this is installing updates. Okay, update is complete. You can get started using your Google Home. Hi, I'm your Google Assistant. I'm here to help. To learn a few things you can do, continue in the Google Home app. Okay, continue. Okay, Google, how far away is the moon? The moon is 238,900 miles from Earth. Pretty cool. Okay, Google, tell me about my day. Good evening, Peter G. It is 7.47 p.m. The weather in Grapevine currently is 46 degrees and clear with a high of 61 degrees. Have a good one. Here's the latest news from NPR News Summary at 7 p.m. today. Support for this podcast and the following message come from Cyber Policy. Okay, Google, Helping stop. Okay, Google, play some music. Playing some music on Google Play Music. Okay, Google, turn it down. Okay, Google, what can you do? There are lots of things I can help you with. For example, you can say, give me 
a random number or what's on my calendar. To see more examples, check out the Google Home app. Okay, Google, stop music. So there you have it. That's uh, Google Home, and uh, we just did the full installation. Um, you're seeing some of the different things that you can do with the app. It's just the Google Home app. It's the same app that you would use with your Chromecast. And uh, there you go, from out of the box and to installed, that is the Google Home at 129. Pretty cool device, uh, even if you're just getting it so you have something around the house to listen to music to. Okay, Google, listen to vlog tracks. Sure, here's your Google Play Music playlist called Vlog Tracks. Thank you.